हेलो दोस्तों इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू हाउ टू सेट अप अ फ्री जूम अकाउंट एंड ऑल्सो आई बी टेलिंग यू हाउ यू कैन अटेंड अ जूम मीटिंग एंड ऑल्सो हाउ यू कैन सेट अप योर ओन जूम मीटिंग्स सो दैट अदर्स कैन जॉइन द जूम मीटिंग सो इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर द कंप्लीट इन्फॉर्मेशन सो वॉच टिल द एंड एंड बाय द एंड ऑफ दिस वीडियो यू वुड बी एन एक्सपर्ट इन ऑपरेटिंग जूम सो दैट यू कैन अटेंड जूम मीटिंग्स यू कैन शेड्यूल मीटिंग्स एंड एवरीथिंग so watch till the end let's begin okay so first let's go to the zoom website or you can directly click the link in the description okay so let me just uh, go to zoom so this is the link zoom.us so go to this link and on the right hand top corner you see sign up it's free okay so that's where you can click and sign up so let's understand what do you get for free okay so here is the price plan and pricing details so in the free version you will be able to host up to 100 participants that means the meeting that you set up 100 people can participate in that unlimited one to one meeting 40 minutes limit on group meetings that means if you are setting up a group meeting up to 40 minutes is allowed Unlim unlimited number of meetings and other features so these are the things that are available in free okay so let's just click on sign up and it's free so for verification please confirm your date of birth okay so let me select that okay so let's continue now here is something you need to you can either enter your personal email id or you can enter your official email id so it's up to you so you there are multiple options there either you can sign in with google or sign in with uh, facebook okay so okay so i'll enter my email id i'll click on sign up it says we have sent an email okay so please click on the confirm link so let me do that so here is the email that has come okay so welcome to zoom to activate your account please click on this button so i'll click on activate account it says welcome to zoom so this is your email id that is reflecting your account has been successfully created please list your name and create a password so let me create give the details so i have entered my name and password okay once you fill that it says uh, confirm password click on continue so uh it says uh, invite your colleagues so i don't want to invite anyone uh say that i am not a robot and uh, i want to skip this section okay now it says start your test meeting so it says start a meeting now let's go to the account okay so now you can see that your account has been created and it reflects your name and everything so here is something you have the quick options that are available host a meeting either you can set up a, a meeting with video off or with video on or screen share on only okay so these are the options that are available or you can also schedule a meeting from here okay so if you click on schedule a meeting here let me just click on this so i can say this as a test meeting uh you can enter the description you can select when it's going to start let me say at 2 pm uh, india time duration uh, it doesn't allow for 1 uh, hour so let me just select for let me select for 30 minutes uh so meeting id generated automatically meeting password i don't want the password okay so it depends upon you if you want to set the password for others to join uh, or if you want them to directly join by clicking on the link okay so i prefer them to just click on the link and join so i am not entering any password here uh, here is something uh video on or off okay when you are setting a meeting you have the option to either enable your video immediately or uh turn it on by yourself later okay so i'll put it as off off for uh, both uh, host and participant so audio the way they can join the meeting okay either they can join by telephone or computer audio so i have selected both let that be like that meeting options if you select this option that means other people can join the meeting before you okay mute participants upon entry so i would always like that the participants are all muted so select this option for that 
uh, enable waiting row that means uh, say for example there's few uh, still few minutes for the meeting to start so people can actually uh, join the link and they'll be in the waiting room okay so that what it indicates uh, record the meeting auto automatically on my local computer so if you want to uh, uh, see the uh, video uh, after the meeting is over you can just enable this option and then click on save okay so now you have created a meeting and uh, for somebody to join this meeting all you need to do is you just have to share this link okay you just have to share this link uh, through email whatsapp whatever you want or you can copy this invitation and send with all the details so this is something that you can send in the email okay which gives the topic name time and everything so that they know when exactly it's going to start correct so once done with this say for example everything is fine now it's time for you to start the meeting so it's very simple on how to start it okay so you see the start this meeting option right next to the one that you have set up say for example you are opening it after some time or something so how do you do that uh, let's say uh, you are in your account right now okay so just click on the meetings okay and you see the meeting that is available here test meeting just click on start this meeting now once you start this meeting there are multiple options uh, for you to start a meeting or attend a meeting you need zoom client installed in your system okay or in your system or on your mobile so what you need to do is if you are not already installed just click on this download and run zoom which is displayed at the bottom here right so you need to click on this since i already installed that is the reason it is showing me open zoom meeting so okay i'll click on open zoom meeting so it will open up the client so you can see this is the client that is opening because i had already installed this okay so let me make it as full screen now you can see that uh, meeting has started so let me come from the beginning so if you want to mute yourself just click on this that will mute you uh, there are multiple options here let me just mute it there are multiple options here you can select the microphone you can uh, select the same device as the system okay uh, and select the speaker so i have selected the speaker also okay and uh, you can also test the connection of uh, speaker and microphone by using this link okay so that's uh, on the things and uh, these are the video settings integrated camera or uh, video settings you can go to that you just have to click on this and it will start the video okay uh, now that i have connected to other video it will not uh, enable this correct so i'll stop this video okay so you just have to click on this so that the video is getting going to get started if you want to say for example you have already started the meeting and you want to invite somebody you just have to click on this invite button either you can send an email through your default email address or gmail or yahoo whatever you want okay or you can simply copy the url okay and send it in whatsapp or something like that whatsapp messenger anything okay so that's invite when you click on this you can see who all have been uh, in the meeting right now see right now i am the only one uh, that is there and you have the option to unmute them or mute them okay and uh, one other thing if somebody says that they are not able to hear or they are not able to see check if their audio and video is enabled or not see in this case it says uh, audio and video both has been disabled that means i have disabled it okay if somebody says that okay they are not able to speak or you are not able to hear them then they might have not enabled the things or when you are speaking if they are not able to hear you then you may need to make sure that your audio is enabled okay next uh, this is the screen share option share screen so when you select this uh, screen by default it will show uh, anything that you are doing on your desktop okay this is whiteboard uh, this is iphone ipad uh, the browser whatever okay so usually uh, you can decide what you want to share uh, with them okay if you have a ppt or something you can share the ppt okay so that's the share option that is there next uh, this is the most important thing that's the chat so here you can actually chat with uh, chat with your uh, participants you can say hi hello whatever you want okay and you can also decide whether you want to send it to only one person or everyone since there is only one person right now uh, i am sending it to only one person but you would be having the option also okay to attend is only panelists something like that okay now here is the option where you want to record it now 
uh, for me it has been automatically enabled i have made it as a default setting to enable the recording but uh, as i said earlier uh, enable recording correct if you want to pause it you can pause it if you want to stop recording you can stop it so that's the recording option that is available so these are all the features that are available in the free version which you can access and once you are done just click on end meeting and make sure you click on end meeting for all if you are the host that means if you have set up the meeting okay or you can just click on leave meeting if you are just joined okay so let me end meeting for all now the moment it's over it starts uh, to convert the video so convert meeting recording okay so it has done and it will ask where to save it okay so it is saving in zoom folder let me click so let me click on okay so you could see so here is my uh, video recorded okay so that's how you uh, work with zoom okay. now let's see how you can attend zoom meeting now in case if you are the participant to join the zoom meeting then all you have to do is just click on the link what they have given okay so either they would have just given you a single link or they might have sent you the invitation now the invitation may look uh, something like this okay if you have got an invitation like this then all you need to do is just click on this link and it will allow you to join to the meeting okay so that's how you join or if they have just given you the link uh, something like this then just uh, click on the link and you should be able to join only in case if they have set a password then you might have to enter the password or else you will be able to directly join to the zoom meeting and attend it so thank you very much i hope uh, this video has helped you if it has helped you then just give a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you are not already done thank you